Alright, what's up guys, Leech here. And in this video today I have a tutorial for you all. It's a uh, basically a partnership sort of tutorial on how to code and cut a banner. So without it all, let me just jump into it. Okay, first of all you have to go all the way. Usually the majority of partnership templates have a partnership box, like such as right here. So first you're gonna do you're gonna give the magic wand tools to fourth one on on the left, and you're gonna select the anywhere on the banner like this. I can do not touch anything. Do not move it up and down because I can screw it up. And second of all, and then next you're gonna go all the way to the top, hold shift, and press and select this like that. So it selects all of this. And then you right click on the layer at the top and you select merge layers. Just give that a second. And then now you need to basically save this banner into another file, like code it basically. Okay, so basically you can press file, new. And the width I use is 950 by 150, in which I'll leave in the description if you don't can't really see that from here. Press OK. Let me switch to this thing over here. And press Control C to copy it. See, this, you copy this layer basically. And you go over here and press Control V to paste it. Okay. Now you're gonna save this banner differently, separately from the whole background. So let me save this as a PNG. Put as tone banner. Okay, okay, okay. Now let me just go into the coding of it, basically. See, I'm a I use a, a site called Image Maps, which basically you can uh, code basically anything for like the banner. Sorry, it's okay. And um, yeah. So basically, you're gonna I'll leave this link to this um site in the description, so you guys can click on that. So basically, you can do is, is press choose file, and I have tone. Partner should be tone banner should be right here. Press OK, and then after that's right here. You press start mapping your image. As you can see, it should be popping up right over here. Give that a few seconds to load. Okay, and then you can do go to continue to next step. You click that, and basically this is where you start coding your banner. Okay, I'm gonna code your. Uh, Tones banner to the way I made it. So money, I designed it. So I'm gonna go to my channel. So first of all, you're gonna go to rectangle, and you try to make like a shape basically over this. Like drag this over, like try to get the whole designer sort of thing, I guess, or whatever how you did it. Okay. And now my channel is right here. So I'm gonna press Control C and copy it. And you're gonna press like, like delete all this stuff right here. And press Control V. Okay, and my, the title is gonna be Designer. And I you press the test the link to make sure everything's okay with that. Make sure send it to the right channel. Okay, send it to my channel. Okay, next I'm gonna and then you press basically you press save. Okay, then do the rectangle again, and you I'm gonna do it over sync since he's a part of sync. Okay, let me just do this. Like so, try to get it perfectly there. Okay, now I'm gonna go to the Synchronize HQ channel. Press Control C, and go delete all this, and press Control V. Okay, the name is Sync. Press Save. I'm gonna test the link to make sure it sends me to the right place, and it does. Okay, press Save, and his Twitter, like so. Okay. Like so. Okay, now I'm gonna just go to his Twitter, press Control C over it, and press Control V to paste it, and has just put the title as Twitter. Let me test the link. Let's do that in just in case. And it sent me to the right Twitter. Okay, press save. And he's partnered with Yash. I'm gonna put uh, Yash's YouTube channel there, basically. Like so. Okay. Just control C. Control V. And yeah. Like so I'll press save. And once you basically done coding your banner, they're gonna go to get your code. And you can see a lot of these up here, so you basically go to HTML code. And you're gonna get this large thing. So I basically press you can press code and you can select the start at the beginning of it and you can press control A. 
You basically just select all of it, and then you press Control C to save it. To whatever it is to copy it. There you go. So let me uh, make a new file on my desktop. Saying, wait a second. Let me show my icons. Wait a second. There you go. Okay, and I just copy paste this code. And basically, the, the um, whoever has a partnership basically knows what to do with this code. So anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed the tutorial. Please feel free to like and comment with your opinions on it and if it worked. Or any other questions you might have regarding it, I'll be glad to help you. So anyway, this has been Leech. I'll talk to you later. Peace.